I'm Alice Fitzgibbon. I go to school in Spa National School, which is in the Spa, which is outside Tralee in Kerry. And the Jet Project was really fun. Our honey is called Spa's Buzzing Honey because we thought it would be good to have kind of a joke in there, like buzzing honey. My idea was Spa's Flapping Flags, which were flags like that would have different kind of countries, colours on them. And we chose honey instead because we thought it would be easier to sell and a lot more people would be more interested in buying the honey and it would help for different illnesses and our honey had special benefits because it was heated to 30 degrees instead of 70 degrees. And I'm on the, I was put into the storytelling team and my role was to make the PowerPoint presentation and to do the interviews for our um, showcase day. We sourced the honey from Anthony Sheehy in camp, who was the, the dad's friend of the person who decided on the, who thought up of the idea. We, he sent us in a um, white container of honey with a tap and we poured the honey into the glass jars we got from alpac.com. And we then, this, the design and production team drew the labels and we, the labels onto the jars and had the lids on. We set them up in the cardboard boxes over in the corner of the classroom for a while and then we decided we should make honey biscuits as well to go with them because it would be good for the um, showcase day for people to sample the honey. All of us had to put in 10 euro ourselves and we made 645 euro I think and we, our profit was 350 euro. The most exciting part of the project for me was, was when the business visitor came in and talked to us about um, how we should like present our product and what would be a good idea for like a stand and what would be good ideas for advertising our product. I learned like a lot about teamwork and I learned different skills I haven't had and I learned that entrepreneurs are people who need to be self-starting and be confident in themselves and I learned that um, there's a lot of research going into making a product instead of just selling it. Our honey is better than other honeys because it isn't blended from honeys around Europe and the world. Our honey is from one source and it is heated to 30 degrees, so it keeps mo all of its beneficial properties, like it aids sleep, it's an ulcer healer, it soothes sore throats, and it contains lots of antioxidants and vitamins that are good for you. We had a bunch of labels designed by different people in the class and the design and production team chose, just, chose which one they thought would be the easiest to draw and would be the most man manageable one to do a good, good number of times. The most difficult moment I think was when um, a load of our honey jars had like way more honey than they needed and we had to scoop it out and put it into different honey jars which didn't have enough and there was some that didn't have much enough still, so we kind of had to even it all out. The biggest thing I learned was the importance of teamwork and cooperation during the project and while you're working. Do I think I'm going to be an entrepreneur? Probably, but I'm not sure yet. I think um, entrepreneurs' life would be kind of um, very self kind of starting and you'd get up early and you'd work quite for long hours and then but you'd still probably get loads out of it and you'd be able to take like the breaks you need and things. So it would kind of be a bit re more relaxed, but you'd be in charge of it all.